Hey guys, Frank Rivoli here, your catching coach, and you are watching Crash Course Catching. Today, we're talking about shin guards. Here we go. So there's two things I want to address about shin guards today, and the first is make sure they fit properly, okay? All too often I see young catchers running around, their shin guards are sliding off when they're trying to run. You want to make sure you fit your shin guard, put it on, tighten it up, and fit it where it's not falling off when you run. They're not sliding over when you block. Make sure they're nice and snug, but not tight where it's cutting off circulation. When you find that spot on each uh, strap, you want to go ahead and you want to tape the straps, all right? Because what that's going to do is that's going to hold um, the strap in place where you have it fitted perfectly. If you don't, it's going to keep coming loose and it might pop off during a game. You got to keep doing it. As you see, I have all mine taped all the way down the line. Second thing, when we're putting our shin guards on, make sure the clips, these guys, are on the outside of your leg. So this would go on my right leg, and the other one would go on my left leg. The reason why is if the clips are on the inside of your legs, when you're running for a ball or making a block, there's a good chance that uh, both shin guards will clip together and hook up on each other, and you're gonna pop up, try to get a ball, and you're gonna fall flat on your face because your shin guards clip together. So again, make sure you fit them, when you fit them, tape them, and when you put them on, make sure the clips are on the outside. Thank you for watching Crash Course Catching today. We'll see you again soon.